Oh. Oh, hey, honey. Watching football. Watching football. K-State's getting their shit kicked in. When are you coming home? What time tonight? Shall I wait up? Figures. Nothing. Oh, shit. I gotta go. Someone's at the front door. All right, I gotta go. Bye. I love you too. Bye. Hello. Greetings and salutations. My name is Mary, and I'm selling Adventure Girl cookies. Would you like to buy a box or two? Adventure Girls, huh? Well... Yeah. They're delicious. Yeah, I'm sure they're great. You know, I just bought some candy bars from the fat kid down the street, so... You don't know what you're missing. Besides, it's going to a great cause. Oh, yeah, what's that? If we sell enough cookies, our squad gets to buy new uniforms. <laughs> Well, you know, <clears throat> I think I'll pass. Maybe next time. I don't think you understood me. Besides, we really need new uniforms. You'd be doing us a really big favor. Well, Mary, I'm not interested. Try the neighbors. I'll be back. OK, well, still won't be interested. I know. Your friend Mary was already here. And I told her the same thing I'm going to tell you. Ready? Not interested. So please, just go mug someone else. <laughs> You're funny. Mary said you had a good sense of humor. Oh, really? She put you up to this? All right, look, I told her I wasn't interested, and I'm serious, all right? Aww. Don't give me that sad face shit. Uh, you just said a naughty word. Yeah, and you're going to hear a lot more if you don't get the hell off my porch. Where are your parents, anyway? Okay, cute. Just have a nice day. Is this a joke? It's 10.30 at night. <laughs> We're light sleepers. <laughs> okay, good night. Kid, get your foot out of my door. Okay, look, you little rodents. Stop here again and I'm calling the cops, you understand? There's a curfew, right? Curfew? Good night. No, they've been out and about all night. What time did you say? Since 10.30. It's almost midnight. That's pretty late. Pretty late? Pre okay, don't you think it's a little strange? Come on, who the hell sells cookies, let alone buys cookies at midnight? No one. Well, sir, they are delicious. Wait, what did you just say? I just bought a box an hour ago. I really hit the spot. I got the munchies late at night. You're serious? So you don't even do anything? Well, until I get another complaint, no. Oh, you're telling me I'm the first one to complain? Maybe you should just buy a box of cookies. They'll probably leave you alone. 
Unbelievable. Two little girls with a baseball bat before. But I'm willing to give it a try. much fun you have in juvie. What, oh, you think this is funny? Your girl's in a lot of trouble, you know. Oh, honey, thank God you're home. What are you doing? What am I doing? These little cretins invaded our house. They've been trying to sell me cookies all night. One of them shot me with a poison arrow. I can barely see! Oh, sweetie. Do you mean these delicious cookies I bought on the way home? These sweet little girls were selling them at the store. I thought I'd surprise you. I ate a whole box on the way home. You girls really know how to make them. Thanks, Mrs. Marshall. <laughs> you didn't want it to be this way, Mr. Marshall, but you left us no choice. Why are you doing this? We told you. 
<laughs> we need new uniforms. I'll see you now. Open wide. And once again today, our top story are these delicious cookies. We take the story live to the streets to get some public reaction. Thanks, Rich. I'm here with Neil Marshall, a local man who has bought a record amount of cookies, an outstanding 300 boxes of them. Pretty amazing. Thanks to patrons like Mr. Marshall, the Adventure Girls have been able to buy brand new uniforms. Neil, what do you think about these great cookies? They're delicious. I can't live without them. Well, he said it. Back to you, Rich. I'll get it, sweet. Hello, sir. It's a beautiful day. I'm selling candy bars so our troop can go to next year's jamboree in Washington, D.C. No thanks, kid. We already bought pizzas from the kid down the street, so... Thanks anyway. They're delicious.